from. My name is Misty Blessing Uba, the Speaker of this Parliament. Parliamentarians are seated here, like usual, with you parliamentarians in diaspora, as we discuss topical issues that affect you and I, be it social, economic, non-political, religious, and general. We'd like to thank GSR 360 Studios, Gamma Communications, Nigerian Breweries, Guinness PLC, Unilever, PLC, we thank you all for being part of this. Here we are, let's unveil the parliamentarians today as we touch this topical issue that 21st century has brought to us. Is it fair or unfair? Before I unveil it, let me unveil the parliamentarians. On my immediate left is Prince Albert Uba. Thank you very much. Good. The next on my immediate right is Jalili Atiku. My people, how are you? And on my far right is Dominic Mokwe. Thank you very much, yes. Good. And so welcome, let us unveil the topic. Social media. The effects on the reading culture of our youths. We will be back after this short commercial break to do justice to this topic. Welcome back. It's still the parliament wherever you're watching from. And so, social media is a 21st century effect. I must say. But has it brought the good tidings to the reading culture of our youths? Even when I don't want to talk about youths, what of we, the adults, has it really brought the positive to us in our reading culture or the negative of us? <laughs> What's your view on this? Uh, thank you <laughs> very much, Mr. Missy. Uh, social media and the effects on the reading culture, uh, I think in Nigeria, the topical issue, like you know, social media is part of the mass media. It's an integral part of the mass media, uh, which purpose is to educate, entertain, and uh, inform. But you see, if we're talking vis-a-vis -vis the reading culture, social media has helped our youth, even the adults, in you know, some of the things we would have known uh, as it were. I mean, you have the Google, which is the all-knowing uh, master, uh, the Wikipedia and all that. It helps our youth in doing researches okay. in the academics. And but so, in your opinion, it is purely positive uh, no, I, I was coming to that. It is it's a, it has ambivalent function. Like I said, the media, the, the mass media is there to educate, entertain, and inform the people, and that is what the social media is doing. But if you are, if you are relating it with the real culture, yeah. you find out that, <coughs> excuse me, uh, most often than not, our youths nowadays no longer have that reading culture uh, as it were you know compared to our uh, days when we're, yeah. growing up, when we're in school because all they do now is go to google download the topics and the points maybe at, 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 at an instance or an exam period when it is needed all right that's one two another ill i think that is major is so many sites that are there in the social media Especially, you know, those sites that are not meant for the growing uh, teenagers. Teenagers. Yes, you, you find that. Especially, anyway, the social media, even though everybody's getting to imbibe uh, by it now, is meant for a section of the society. Right. Even though, even though, even the bourgeoisie, even though everybody's coming to imbibe by it, you know, the bourgeois uh, kids have the opportunity that is. Uh, near far, near far away from those of the indigent students, to go into sites, websites that are that are not known to us as adults. And you talk about YouTube; over one thousand videos are being downloaded in an hour, in every one hour in YouTube. And these are kids, are youths, spend most of the time viewing on it this side including 
some obscene or all sins in, 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 in these sites. And so ample time is being spent yeah. watching this obscene film and, and the social media than bending down to read their books. Okay. The effect of social media and our reading culture. Now, let's look at this. Reading and writing have seen to be seen. You read and you write. But social media can best be described as websites and applications that enable users to create, share content, and participate in social networking. And so naturally, from the definition, it's supposed to be a very good idea. But here we are. Let's look at the writing skills. Today, our writing skills and the effect of uh, social media. Our people can no longer write complete sentence without an abbreviation. Yes. Yeah, this, that's, you see, that's one of the ills of the social media. Now, you want to write you, which is spelled naturally as Y-O-U. It is abbreviated to only you. you. All right? But, and like I said, the ill, one of the yeah. ills is that when you see to write an international exams. Yeah, there are a whole lot of things that you can no longer do. This is, the, this is the effect of social media. media. It affects our students in school, and that's why we we'll have to sit our kids down. And let them understand the difference between the social angle of it and the educational side of it. You are correct. That's what that says. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, Atiku, the, you know, the, you know, the writing skills, the writing skills that used to be there while we were growing up. Of course, I, I am one of those who uh, advocate for freedom of expression and freedom of association. But I want to a little bit go like an old person here. I want to also uh, 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 say that the social media should be banned in school completely. Because it affects the language of the people, okay. I mean, especially the students, yeah. those who are in the information stage. Yeah. Because it doesn't make them to think. So it should be banned completely, completely in banned basic school. In basic school. Except in high school. Get to the, because the English media like said, it's 18 years. And above. And above. Like, you know, like, like, like you said before, yeah. in the terms and condition, they say age. There's an age limit. Which is there. So like, it, is, it, is not, it is not put into practice. Yeah. You allow, just like my brother said there, yeah, you allow uh, secondary school students to use the yeah. iPhone, uh, iPhone laptop, they can be, and you know, you can even, you can even, you can, you can, you can be, listen to the word, it's a chat, sex, yes, you know, we just, you know, it's something that's not supposed to come to the, 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 the vocabulary of yes. someone who is chatting, yeah, yes. sex chatting, who is forming character, yeah, and so, so it means that at that point, that character cannot be formed can, properly, can, properly. Yes, yeah. good, now, it goes for that, now, um, uh, Prince, yes, must we remain with this orthodox way of researching things that I must have seven books on the table because I'm researching? Why don't I just go straight to a palm top, a laptop, or even a phone and get the details that I want? Well, uh, well, if I, I will tell you that we mustn't remain because the only thing that has remained permanent is change itself. Good, and so that is where we're changing. Yeah, we we'll have to change. But when we are changing, you should know where to draw the line. Okay. One thing I have discovered, and I have always said it, is that this social media thing, this internet thing, has not fully helped us. Except that now, except that we have ourselves in it. No, except that now that we have a library, library, a yeah. library. Yeah. All right. It, there is there is strength in researching. There is strength in reading from several authors. Yeah. There is strength in reading from several authors that research on a particular topic. Yes. But what I have discovered is that there is no broad spectrum yeah. of, of definition of terms. Yeah, that's you know that happens. That they they out, they yeah. out in the social in the in the internet or whatever yeah. you call it. Yeah. Alright, and that affects like I said, I wanted to initiate on why I said it destroyed research. Yeah. And when you research, like the name implies, yeah. it means having to look at one or two or three other several other thoughts. Yeah. yeah. That has negative impact. Yeah. So that is why I came up with the idea that sole dependence on, on social media yeah. has negative impact yes. in research. Yeah. In research work. 
Because all you, do, all you just do is download and submit. All right? Yeah. And, and, and the professor reading your research work will know where you have downloaded it. Yeah. Because he or she too had come to that site. And so it is it's a 21st century issue. Sorry? If it's a 21st century issue. Yes. If, if a professor like me, my my book, yes. is going to go on the same place where I got it, yes. then, then that is his like I tell you, there are schools yeah. abroad in the UK, yeah. to be precise, that if you go to pick somebody's ex work, yeah. a line yeah. with the, the researcher who is the idea that you did, that yeah. you, you, you presented, yeah. they disregard they that work. Okay. They abandon it because they know that you have picked stuff, and that is plagiarism. Yeah. We have no respect for plagiarism. Yeah. In this thing, first, like you said, in the first century. Yeah. And so, uh, oh yeah, uh, so I, I want to, I want to react to what the yeah. just said. We, we have a lot of respect for plagiarism. In the part of this world, which is our country, there have a lot of corruption. Yeah. You should know that anything goes, anything can happen. If you go to an advanced, but that's why we must correct it. Yeah. Yeah, we must correct it. But it does, it does, it does, it does not, it doesn't mean, mean that I work. The internet of men is making you corrupt. No, 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 no. it is not. The internet, don't forget, don't let us link me to this together. Yeah. Internet is and different from the internet of social media. Yeah, that's correct. Like, like a researcher, yeah. I could go go, go to the Google yeah. and look at materials. You can see thousands, yes. thousands of materials. Yes. You will receive it to a particular one. Thousands. I will give you one example. Yeah. I was doing a research on myself yeah. as a Jalili article. Yes. The word Jalili, yeah. it is an Arab word that have been that have been adopted by the Yoruba. <laughs> <laughs> right. So it doesn't have a meaning anyway. Yeah, no, no, the meaning is yes. somewhere. So I was I saying, mean. I want to know the meaning of Jalili from another perspective. Yeah, yeah. I saw thousands of meanings of that are not even yes. Yeah. So that one made me you know, begin to think, yeah, okay, now my the, 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 my, my father's I'm way to a way of Muslim. Pick this language, change it to yeah, nothing. And give it a unique form. From. You understand? But that uniqueness has lost the original I meaning mean, of it. Of course. That's exactly what the modern day is also about. Yeah. So the internet has helped me. So that is where the ears come from. That's where the ears come from. No, no, no. You're saying that that is no, no, the potential no. of internet. That was saying the original meaning of something is lost. No, no, it says that it lost the language. But it has helped him to realize it. Yes. So, but what we're talking about internet is different from social media. Okay. The social media are the ones that yeah, you see networking. That is where, social network. What is so, well, sociality? Yeah. Social this is that where yeah. all your friends are there, you yeah. and and everyone share, share, share content. Share yeah, content. Yeah, you to share content. Yes. So but you go I could not, I could be in social media with professors. Yeah. We are all professors. Yes. I um, share ideas about things that are pertaining to our profession. Yeah. But when you take it further than I'm um, talking about sex, you talk about this, you talk about irrelevant things to the people. Yeah, of okay. everything that has advantage is it is advantage. Oh, so so for that I'm saying that internet does not discourage research. Okay. Now um, I was uh, 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 Dominic. Uh, it does because Dominic. it's Apple time. Dominic. Now, you know, like we're talking about uh, writing. Now, somebody had had to write, you know, was going to wish somebody wishing you happy birthday and long life and prosperity. <laughs> you know, I was amazed when I looked at, you know, the phone of the person he sent it to. You would not, you would not believe. He just wrote W-H-L-I-N-P-P-P. -P 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 and the man was saying, what is the meaning of this? You, you, you understand? We have to call somebody you know, that is far much younger. What is this with the P that is written here? <laughs> you know, and then I say, so I don't know, I say that what he's saying is it's wishing you a long, long life. You know, as far as I'm concerned, so to me, it has completely destroyed the psyche, the writing and the reading culture of the youth. And, 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 and I am, I am also an insult to the man he or she said it to because you are not able to age this. <laughs> yes, that's true. You are not able yeah. to age me. Yeah. If, if, if you are saying it to me because we are both 15 years old, yeah. and I see, I should know this thing is happy, we should be happy, play more, play more life, or whatever, that you are trying to say because I know this is things we do together in class where we do in school as things we have to do. Yeah. But, but not when I am 15 years old. I was saying it to him. I was saying it to him. I was saying it to him. That means I'm insulting him. I left child should be 424. And he says, he says, don't forget that we are already we are living in the era where the human value in our cultural system is already. Yeah, already yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Okay, okay
You see, the internet, the social media brought a new sculpture yeah. that doesn't have values for for all this you are yeah, what you know, for all that from the 20th yes for what you believe me see that eroded all those and all those values and that's why i'm saying that this social media should be bad for under 18 uh, oh. 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 but it's this no. day for 18 and we know okay and i'm saying this is what i'm saying like, no, 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 our no, parents no. yes are the bone well, of foundation so they well, have not check uh, these things Dominic, on your last line advice well if I want to advise here is this: If you know you have a child who is between one to fifteen years old, he or she shouldn't go near cell phones, which has anything that comes to do with internet or social media, social media applications. applications. That's mine. Article. Yeah, does uh, a child of two years have sex? No. No. If that is no, then the same thing should go to social media. Yeah. The age limits should be restricted, should be should be enforced. Yeah. As stated in the rules and regulations of, of, yeah, of, 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 of the social media, it should be real. it should be enforced. Prince. See, everything boils down to the parents. Maybe in in subsequent time we will have to discuss the role of parents in all of this. Yes. It the role of parents it, and yes, it is it is it is equipment upon parents to know and pry into what their kids do. are doing. All right. If the parents, of course, we have various types of parents. Yeah, you know, some are just guardians. Some, some, some. Yeah, are, some are getting us. Yeah, the criminologists will tell you that we have uh, permissive uh, permissive parents, we have autocratic parents, and we have authoritarian parents. All right, maybe that's the topic for another. Uh, <laughs> so what I'm trying to say is that parents have a role to play in this, all of this. Yes. All right, it is important that you check what your kids are doing. All right, it is not a question of oh, I am an affluent parent. I have to buy all the sophisticated gadgets for my kids. You are invariably and indirectly destroying that child because at that age there are certain things he shouldn't be privy to. Yeah, that now at that point it is. Yes. Okay, that's it. And so, uh, our parliamentarian said diaspora would like to say, please differentiate between the social activities, official activities, and the educational activities. You cannot be writing an official mail and you're writing you as in you instead of Y O U. You cannot be writing an official mail and instead of writing please, yeah. you're writing P L S. You understand? I mean. And so, I think there must be a clear demarcation between the social activities, educational activities, and official activities. Until next week, we'll come back with another exciting topic on the parliament. From us parliamentarians here, we say thank you, good night, and God bless. It's a pleasure.